In this video I'm going to show you how to update profiles in Mamaki Raster Link. To do this I'm going to go to my start menu, I'm going to go to all programs, I'm going to find Mamaki Raster Link. I'm then going to go down to my update and I'm going to go to profile update. This will open the profile update window. You will need the internet to download profiles for the printer. I'm going to go to next. I'm going to choose the printer in which I'm downloading the profiles for. I'm also going to make sure I choose the correct ink type by pressing the little plus symbol to the left hand side of it. My printer is SS21. I'm going to go to next. I'm then going to tell it to just show me all of the profiles that are available. If you do your profile updates regularly, you can just tell it to show only the new release profiles. I'm going to press next. It's then going to find all the profiles that are available for me. This sometimes takes a little while depending on your internet speed. Once it's found them, it will put them all in a list. and we can select the ones that we want to use. As you can see it downloads profiles from 3M, Avery, Hexis, Intercoat, Metamark, Oracle, so it brings in all the main profiles that are available for your printer. For this, pro uh, for this printer we have 728 profiles available. Some people like to install them all, some people like to just install select ones that they're using. Once you select a profile that you'd like, you press next and it will install it for you. Obviously you can install all of them at the same time but this will take a little while. and that's now been installed. So I'm going to press finish and you'll now see if I open up Rasterlink 6 again. First of all it will actually install your profile for you as you open it up automatically. I'm going to select my job, I'm going to go to quality and you'll now see I've got now got that 3M profile available to use. Once you've done that you're ready to print. 